Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss a few multiple choice questions on endocrinology. So this is the ninth sets of questions. So if you are interested, you may go through my initial eight sets of multiple choice questions on endocrinology. Let's start. Number one. A surgical specimen from an adrenal mass is examined under the microscope. Histological examination reveals cells with granular cytoplasm, stiffened chromatin, and prominent nucleoli arranged in a nested or gel balloon pattern. Immunologic immuno Histochemical staining shows positive staining for chromogranin and synaptophysin. What is the most likely histopathological diagnosis? So, this is the histopathology. We got that granular cytoplasm, cells with granular cytoplasm, stippled. Chromatin, chromatin, and prominent nucleoli arranged in a nested or gel balloon pattern. And immunohistochemical staining shows positive staining for chroma, chromogranin, and synaptophysin. So, what is the diagnosis? Diagnosis is what? Adrenal adenoma. Adrenal cell carcinoma, pheochromocytoma, ganglioneuroma, carcinoid tumor. Answer should be C. Pheochromocytoma. Pheochromocytoma. Question number two. A 30 year old female with a family history of multiple endocrine neoplasia type 2 undergo genetic testing and is found to have mutation in the rat proton cogene and the rat proton cogene she is asymptomatic but has elevated levels of plasma metanephrine and abnormal mri reveals bilateral adrenal masses what is the most likely diagnosis Okay, choices are A. Pheochromocytoma, B. Cortical carcinoma, C. Adrenal adenoma, D. Endosterone producing adenoma, E. Paraganglioma. This is the most likely diagnosis. Okay, so diagnosis is Pheochromocytoma. This is the diagnosis. Pheochromocytoma is a tumor of the adrenal medulla. It may be bilateral in 10% cases. <coughs> Question number 3. A 35 year old patient presents with paroxysmal hypertension, headache, and diaphoresis. The clinical suspect fiction of pheochromocytoma is high. What is the most appropriate initial diagnostic test for confirming the diagnosis? Most appropriate initial diagnostic test for pheochromocytoma is what? A 24-hour urine cortisol, plasma metanephrine, serum chromocrenin, Abdominal ultrasound, chromatin suppression test. So, what is the most appropriate initial diagnosis? Diagnostic test. Okay, question number three. Answer should be what? Answer should be B. Plasma metanephrines. Plasma metanephrine most appropriate initial diagnostic test for pheochromocytoma is the de determination of plasma metanephrine okay 
let's go to the fourth question a 45 year old patient presents with flushing diarrhea wheezing the symptoms are episodic and accompanied by significant facial flushing. The clinician suspects carcinoid syndrome. What is the most specific diagnostic test to confirm the presence of carcinoid tumors? Okay. So, we are looking for specific diagnostic test for carcinoid syndrome. So we have the choices like A, serum serotonin level, B, liver function test, C, chromogranin A levels, D, octreotide scan, E, urinary 5-hydroxy indole acetic acid, or 5 HIAA levels. Okay. What is the correct answer? Okay. Correct answer. What is the specific diagnostic test for carcinoid syndrome? Serum serotonin level, liver function test, chromogranin A level, octreotide scan, urinary 5 hydroxyindole acetic acid levels. For carcinoid tumor, our answer should be E. This is the answer E. Urinary 5 hydroxyindole acetic acid levels. Okay, now go to the question number 5. A 35 year old patient known hypertension is incidentally found to have unilateral adrenal mass consistent, consistent with phucomocytoma on imaging studies. The patient is asymptomatic. What is the most appropriate initial treatment to stabilize the patient before definitive? surgical intervention so our aim is to get stabilization of pheochromocytoma patient prior to, prior to surgery choices are beta blocker therapy b alpha blocker therapy c intravenous fluid d corticosteroid therapy e phenoxybenzamine beta blocker and metarosine so, what is the appropriate answer for stabilization of pheochromocytoma prior to surgery? Okay, what is the initial treatment? Okay, initial treatment is stabilization. Okay, how can you manage this patient? This diagnosis is E. Phenoxid benjamin, beta blocker, and metyrosine. So, E is the correct answer. Okay. This is the correct answer. Okay. So, that's all about the questions, case test question on endocrinology 9. If you have any question to me please feel free to ask me please share the information to your friends please support my channel and please subscribe me have a nice wonderful and blessed day bye now